is how we fucking party. YouTube, how's it going there, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Jody Echo signing up for some Black Ops 3 beta. Yes, the beta came, the beta went, so it's all finito and done for the PS4 and the Xbox One. So next time that we should be seeing it shall, will be come November. Um, so yeah, I decided to end up doing my actual impressions as uh, of the beta after it kind of it is long gone uh, because I wanted to actually do a fair assessment of what the actual game is like. Um, as a disclaimer, really quickly though, I do apologize for the quality of the feed, at least on my end as I'm uh, doing this commentary. It looks very blurry, like dog shit, to be quite honest. But I'm having issues with my Elgato, and so I uh, ripped this uh, from my Twitch stream because that was the only way for me to get it. And my connectivity here, where I'm living at, is not the greatest for streaming, um, so this was the best quality uh, that I can end up uh, using at the time being. Um, so I do apologize for that. So let's start out with the actual negatives of this game. Um, I don't know if it's uh, something that they purposely did or it's just an actual beta-ism. Um, first and foremost, the game freezing up. I didn't know what, exactly what was going on with that, you know, why it was it occurring. Um, but I'm pretty sure it was just a beta-isms. Um, a lot of things that could be negative about this game could be about beta-isms. Um... So yeah, the it freezing up, you know, I, I I didn't exactly enjoy that too much. You know, you're trying to get into it, you know, connect with your friends, and it you know it locks up, you know, your your game pretty much. Uh, at one instance, it did end up locking up, uh, you know, my Xbox One, and I had to actually shut it down and it ended up uh, rebooting it up. But that was at least one time, and that was uh, later on. Um, so I don't know exactly if they're going to be doing skill-based matchmaking with this one, as I end up hearing as a rumor. Um, I pray to God that they don't. Um, I hope it goes back to the actual Black Ops 2 days, you know, when there it was, I think it was actually dedicated servers. Um, so, or best connectivity or whatever the hell this shit was. Um, so I hope it actually stays with that and not the skill based matchmaking shit that they try to implement in advanced warfare because that's what to make the game terrible besides other things. Um, yeah, that was uh, that was pretty bad uh, on their part because yeah, there be some you know some days or some matches that you know it would be spot on. You know things seems to be moving very you know quickly and erratic. But then again, that could be my eyes trying to adjust from you know me play hardcore uh, doing Destiny to doing this one, which it was a uh, uh, pretty smooth uh, smooth uh, graphics. You know I did end up uh, reading uh, that. Um, that the PlayStation 4, they had like 1080p, but they were dropping frames. And why uh, Xbox One, they had 900p, and it was doing uh, just fine, you know, seamless smooth. So I don't know if that has anything to actually do with it, whether or not it was actually 60 frames per second or whatever. Um, but, yeah. And then, uh, I sorry, I kind of went on a tangent with that one. Um, but, yeah, you know, because I know Destiny was uh, 30 frames, so maybe this one was 60. And you know, maybe because, you know, it was a bit more quicker. Um, so there's a little bit of a difference with that one, which is, it's not bad. It's just, you know, me just kind of tangent, you know, least saying, um, I didn't like the fact that I couldn't join my friends, you know, as easy as everybody thinks it was. Um, somebody had to end up initiating the invites because they had, uh, an option, you know, a little social menu that you can no joke end up, you know, clicking to join that never worked. It probably like worked like, you know, twice. And then the rest of the time, it was, you know, just, it was just shit. Um, so, and then, you know, when that ended up happening, and, um, you know, other people's stuff would end up uh, freezing up. Uh, so, it was, you know, it was just horrible trying to actually end up joining other people. Um, so yeah, connectivity, um, uh, friends, um... I don't know if the connectivity had to do with game chat. I mean, I, I had it only talked to them through party chat, so it was pretty shit too. Um, let's see, what are the bad points? I, I, I knew there was there's a couple more, so was like, I apologize. I 
I'm being fairly uh, freehand right now with, with this commentary, so I'm not, you know, having this stuff scripted down like I should be. Um, the weapons, yeah, that was another one. Uh, the shotguns were uh, were inconsistent. You know, at one minute, you know, I'm cross mapping people, and the next minute, I'm getting hit markers with the barrel up in somebody's face. So yeah, that was uh, one big thing that I think that uh, that Treyarch. Uh, needs to actually end up uh, looking at a bit more um so that way because you know shotguns need to be at their place at the close range uh type of stuff you know not you know being uh a, a devastator in you know in open uh open map uh, as the ones that you guys are kind of witnessing now um i also didn't like the 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 hit boxes it seemed a, a little bit short i mean if they would have supposed to amp up uh, the armor or health or whatever the hell you want to freaking call it you know just by a slight bit you know because for it to be you know i see you you see me at the same time and whoever pulls the trigger first wins you know if you know if i was supposed to you know jump away and whatnot you know get somewhat of a, a somehow of, a, of an advantage you know maybe or you know i was you know running down an alley you know I turn around and, you know, hides behind, you know, a rock or something, turn around and then shoot you and still die, you know, with something that's supposed to be more, you know, overpowering, you know, it's like, eh, you know, it, it, it's a so-so, so it's like, you know, maybe I might be just bitching, you know, but maybe I might end up having some, uh, somewhat of a valid point, um, so it's like, yeah, that's, that's pretty much, uh, for all the negativities, um, uh, with the specialists that they ended up going with, I ended up playing almost every single one of them. Uh, I think I might have missed out on uh, maybe like five of them. Um, you know, there was, uh, the cloaking guy, uh, there was, uh, the dude with the minigun. Um, I ended up missing out on the kinetic armor, the, the one that ends up repelling bullets. And I ended up missing out on the person who doubles, uh, that has, uh, where your score streaks are kind of pretty much get doubled up. You know, your your kills or whatnot, your score points ends up uh, doubling up. Yeah, I missed out on those. Um, no, but the specialists they, they seem uh, they seem pretty legit. You know, yes, a, a lot of them happen to mimic uh, some of the, the specials from Destiny. And it's like, to be quite honest, I don't care. You know, I love Destiny. You know, and this game is uh, it it it's up there uh, with it now. Uh, even while we were, uh, playing, you know, the, the guys, uh, from Top Guns, uh, we were, we would end up calling them out, uh, you know, people using their, their specials as if, as if we were playing Destiny, so I thought that was pretty funny. Um, the concussion grenades and the flashbangs, like, holy shit, you know, you had to be level 34, I think it was, in order to get tack mask on, and, but before that, you were, like, stunned, you know, for, like, a good hot minute, uh, not being able to move, not being able to do shit, you know, and you're just praying to God that, you know, that the person was right in front of your barrel while you're squeezing, squeezing the trigger and stuff to end up getting them freaking killed because if not, your ass was, you know, pretty much guaranteed dead, you know, unless if you had a freaking concussion of your own. Um, yeah, that was another freaking annoying ass thing. Um, I like the customizations of this, you know, you can literally end up wasting all 10 perks that you end up having, um, on one weapon you know my favorite weapon being uh, this beautiful thing that you see with me uh, right now is the is the BMR is the first LMG to end up getting the very first weapon you know one of them at least and I you know customized it to the point that all I had for my person was flak jacket and tack mask the rest of it it went all to the weapon and with the different variants and stuff so it's like yeah I had a lot of fun with this weapon um, yeah this, uh, yeah, specialists were evenly timed. Yeah, uh, the paint shop, I, it was a hit and miss. You know, it was a betaism of why it wasn't exactly working all that much. Uh, so, you know, I had at one point like a giant spider, and I didn't even realize it till I saw some of my, you know, miniature game clips that I ended up recording for through the, through the upload, uh, system. But yeah, so it's like I I've seen some pretty cool design works with that one, and it's like it's gonna be pretty damn awesome to actually get that thing full up spinning and running. Um, so yeah, 
if you guys end up playing the beta, let me know what you guys end up thinking. Um, I do have some bonus clips at the end, uh, so stick around to end up uh, enjoying those. Uh, so yeah, comment down below what you guys end up liking, what you guys end up hating. Uh, don't forget to end up liking and share, and uh, so that way other people can view it too. And this is your boy Jody Echo signing out. Peace.